Hi guys and welcome to another best possible squad builder by myself Bates and 87 It's the second one we've done on FIFA 15 Ultimate Team and you may notice by the background it's a little bit different and that is because the Xbox 360 has now got season ticket and we are taking advantage of not wasting our gameplay time on um, on this on next gen uh, by doing the squad builders because that takes about 10 minutes uh, to do that anyway so what we've decided to do um, is do the squad builders on Xbox season ticket because we're uh, unlimited time till Thursday uh, and do the gameplay on the Xbox One and I think I've still got about an hour left so that's going to struggle to get some games but we are doing the best possible Air Division team today that is the uh, the Dutch League if you didn't know we did do it a few weeks ago on FIFA 14 and we thought we'd start it off afresh as it is quite a cheap team this year now if any of you guys do want any uh, MSP PSN codes or cheap game codes as well make sure you check out G2A.com their link is down below in the description if you use discount code B87 as well you do get a bit of discount on the total order and you can get loaded up on your MSP and stuff like that. So, let's have a look at the goalkeeper. you got a choice between Zoet and uh, Vermeer. And we went with Vermeer this time just to see what he's like. He was not bad last year. Um, and, to be honest, keepers aren't that good this year so far. Whether the first patch does change that, we'll have to wait and see. Anyway, also guys, if we can try and smash over 3,000 likes, that'd be absolutely awesome. And if any of you guys have used any of the players in the team, let me know in the comment section below as well. In the middle centre-back, we have the slowest of the three, which is uh, <laughs> Belland. Yeah, that's fucking very immature, Bateson. Stop that. Now, on the left-hand side, we do have Moisander um, with 67 pace as well. Uh, he has 76 defending and 74 physical. And to finish off, we do have a player who a lot of people enjoyed last year as a silver, and it is Veltman. I love this guy, and he's gone up to a non-rare gold now as well. 69 pace, which I think he's dropped down a little bit. Uh, 71 dribbling, 70, 71 physical, and 77 defending. So not a bad defence, and actually we lined it up like that as well, so he was on the left-hand side. In the 2CM two two spots in the middle on the left, we do have Classy, the guy who everyone says looks like Rossi HD. And then on the right-hand side, we do have Shaz as well, the 75-rated uh, centre mid. On the right midfield, we have our man Nassing, uh, 93 pace, 4-star skills, 71 passing, and uh, 76 dribbling. Quite a tidy little player, and if you do that overpowered skill move of the spin, uh, I'm sure you can have a lot of fun with him. But the main player in this team, the one which costs the most, money is the person in the left midfield position he's wasted at the left midfield position but yet again because we are, are limited with the right backs and left backs we're having to use a three at the back formation he has a five star skills 91 pace 84 dribbling 75 physical and 72 passing 71 shooting not that bad but like i said guys he is wasted at the left midfield position so i reckon you change that uh, when you actually do go into the uh, game and play him uh, as a left wing i definitely recommend doing that in the cam position we do have wijnaldum uh, um, he was one of my first packs, actually. 83 pace, 84 dribbling, 72 physical, 70 passing, and 73 shooting, which isn't that bad. And I've also just noticed that the um, the free at uh, the bat formation, this one, doesn't actually link with that centre back, which is. I don't, are them links different to last year? Maybe you guys can let me know in the comment section below. Now, this team finishes off with two uh, strikers. On the left hand side, we do have Nessid. Um, with 72 pace who is the fastest 74 physical as well and decent shooting with 76 and then on the right hand side we do have De Jong who I complained about a lot last time I used him and guess what he's exactly the same on this game he's not bad at finishing but everything else he is absolutely terrible so guys in front of you is the best possible A division team available to you on FIFA 15 Ultimate Team I really hope you've enjoyed it make sure you take note of them strong links you can get like if you change there to there um, you could even change um Get some decent hybrids if you wanted to use the likes of uh, Depay and whatnot. Wijnaldum, the, the rare gold players are the best players in this team. Wijnaldum, Depay and also Narsing. And also the standout player who was quite cheap was none other than Veltman as well, which can pick up for around discard value. So drop a like rating if you haven't already. Subscribe if you're not subscribed. And comment down below if you've used any of these players and what you do think of them. And what you think the final price of Depay is going to be in the next couple of weeks. So, initially, this team felt fucking awesome. We absolutely smashed the first guy. Like I said, guys, we are playing three games uh, currently with the squad builders just because of the fact that we are limited with EA access. But the fact that I've been able to move it onto the Xbox 360 to do the squad builder, and it looked very similar, it has made my life a lot easier. So, in the first game, we went absolutely ham. Depay was having fun, which Naldon was fun, and so was Nas Singh. The strikers I struggled with, even though they were pretty tidy at finishing. But when it comes to the last two games where I got absolutely 
smashed. Um, they were absolutely horrendous. They couldn't do anything. And I realised in this game and doing this squad builder, guys, that three out of the back formations people are going to struggle with at the start, especially me. As soon as I start playing it for good and actually building a strong team to play with, um, I reckon a four at the back formation is going to be my best option just to get used to the game. But if you guys have any tips on how to score goals, if you have any tips about how to use any of these players, let them know in the comments below. I do read them quite heavily and uh, I do moderate my comment section as well, as you do know. So subscribe for more awesome FIFA 15 content. Drop a like, rate, and try to smash for 3,000 likes. And uh, yeah, until next time, guys, see you all later. Have a very, very nice day.